Italian. This very night before the cock crows, you will deny me three times. Peter said to him, Even though I must die with you, I will not deny you. Again he went away for the second time and prayed, My father, if this cannot pass unless I drink it, your will be done. Again he came and found them sleeping, for their eyes were heavy. So leaving them again, he went away and prayed for the third time, saying the same words. Then he came to the disciples and said to them, Are you still sleeping and taking your rest? See, the hour is at hand, and the Son of Man is betrayed into the hands of sinners. Get up, let us be going. See, my betrayer is at hand. He went out to the porch, another servant girl saw him, and she said to the bystanders, This man was with Jesus of Nazareth. Again he denied him with an oath, I do not know this man. After a little while, the bystanders came up and said to Peter, Certainly you are also one of them, for your accent betrays you. Then he began to curse and he swore, I do not know the man. At that moment the cock crowed. Then Peter remembered what Jesus had said, Before the cock crows, you will deny me three times. And he went out and wept bitterly. I have sinned by betraying innocent blood. But they said, What is that to us? See to it yourself. Throwing down the pieces of silver in the temple, he departed. And he went and hanged himself. Now the chief priests and the elders persuaded the crowds to ask for Barabbas and to have Jesus killed. The governor again said to them, Which of the two do you want me to release for you? And they said, Barabbas! Pilate said to them, Then what should I do with Jesus, who is called the Messiah? All of them said, Let him be crucified. Then Pilate asked, Why? What evil has he done? But they shouted all the more, Let, Let him be crucified! And when they came to a place called Golgotha, which means place of a skull, they offered him wine to drink, mixed with gold. But when he tasted it, he would not drink it. And when they had crucified him, they divided his clothes among themselves by casting lots. Then they sat down there and kept watch over him. Over his head they put the charge against him, which read, This is Jesus, the King of the Jews.